Right guys, how's it going? Miller here. Um, been itching to show these off and been itching to get hold of these for ages. I finally managed to get hold of it. Uh, I didn't need to open the box because as you can see, the dog tried to help me doing it. Um, wasn't happy when I found that, but hey ho. So we'll slide this out and we'll have a look. Um, I know there's been quite a few showcases and reviews on these, but I've wanted to get hold of these for a while so I just wanted to show you guys that I'd got hold of it so obviously they're from Bloody Miniatures um, and when I saw these uh, I'd been itching to get hold of it but I hadn't had payday and I was holding off from buying them so just had payday and these would come really quick I think I bought them uh, Monday no, Tuesday, because I've got paid Tuesday, so I think I bought them Tuesday night. And, oh my god, these are huge. Wow. And they are gorgeous. Um, and yeah, I think they were there with, uh, here within a couple of days. These are... Look, these look awesome. Very much like Bicorn sort of size. And I think, of, well, they were uh, sculpted by the same man who did the ones from Bicom and they're a really nice size so obviously as a man carrying a pole arm but you could actually fit a flagpole in there um, these obviously don't have specific reasons they they can be used for uh, skirmish games um, they could be used for dragoons especially ones like this or dismounted cavalry um, Oh, not standing up right. Stand up. No, he's sleeping that one then. But they are some really, really nice figures. Very nice. Um, uh, this was the Wolf's Company, which was all of the ones that the guys recently released uh, in one deal. I think you got a little bit off. Um, I think it was £30 all in. I don't think there was anything for postage. I can't remember. Uh, in fact, actually, I think it was on the box. £1.83 for postage. There you go. Not focusing on the men, are they? It's focusing on behind. Come on. Ain't having it. But, so glad to get hold of these. Since uh, Martin showed them to us the other, well, a little while ago, I've been wanting to get hold of them, so very happy. And they look like they're going to be quite nice and easy to paint. Nice, solid uh, sculpt. There's no finicky little straps and bandoliers and things that are quite hard to pick out. It'll be very fun to pick to paint these up. Not too sure how I'm going to base them. Uh, might do them individually or might do them on multi bases. Um, as they're a full on hope sort of style, I'll uh, probably do them individually. So these are the pole arms. We've got a what we got? Halberd either side and two parts ends in the middle. So two sergeants and two officers. Very nice. And yeah, so these would fit in his arms. So he looks very sergeant-esque. And then I would have said that these would have been the officers, but they've all got things in their hands. So maybe this is the officer. It's come off, so he can have the parts in. Very cool. Very nice. Definitely worth, uh, or recommend picking them up. Um, and I think he's got a new lot coming out soon, another 30 to be released. Um, so keep an eye out on his website and uh, we'll see what comes out. Uh, but that's it for now on these. Just thought you guys might like to quickly just see that I've got them. And I'll be painting them up and showing them off fairly soon. But that's it for now guys. Bye for now.